So today is March 23rd, 2023, and that means Ramadan just begun. 30 days ahead of us that we're not allowed to eat anything outside of home until iftar. So iftar is the time that people try to fast from suhoor in Arabic language until iftar. It's, it's around 12 hours to 14 hours by by the rule of Islam, and in a very conservative country, Oman is not gonna allow you to eat anything outside. So it's not about us, it's about everybody. And that means all the restaurants and any place that you can eat something during the day are about to be closed. But one good thing is about to happen. So the nightlife is about to start and things become interesting because people try to celebrate their days during the night. <laughs> So you see the very first night of Ramadan and the club is closed, like nobody's there. No bar, no club. So we're at one of the biggest and one of the most important park in Muscat, Kurram's National Park. Uh, it is one of the most important ones because I think it's the oldest park yes. among the other parks. And it's huge, like you can just walk into it and spend time. But nobody's here because it's close to Iftar in Ramadan and people are actually eating right now in their home. But they will join definitely. And we're here to chill. It's just cool that nobody's here. That's, that's a point for itself. Okay, dinner time. Uh, same old place, Baba Salem. It's, it's, it's a Turkish restaurant in the middle of Oman. never tried one of these but they look strange we should test them yeah yeah for Ramadan a lot of special offer here in the mall as well cool I like it so I've never seen these weird looking bananas and we thought maybe we can try one in front of the camera look at these unbelievable maybe just one of them let's just go for one okay uh, that's good okay cool So the, biggest pro so the biggest problem that I have in Oman is my camera, my big camera. Because when you have that big camera with big lens and a tripod and you go to stores, people freak out. It's like, what is going on here? I think if you have a gun in your hand, it draws less attention than, than the camera. Look at this. People literally freak out when you see this. Like, I'm like, okay. <laughs> And because of that, I should have my iPhone with me. And well, an iPhone compared to what I have there as, as, as my main camera, it's just like nothing. The quality is it's not comparable, you know, and that's a problem. That's a big problem and I don't like it. And I don't know what to do with it. I don't think in other countries people have the same problem, but it's a big problem to me. <laughs> 